Can you tell us uh, a little about your study named ART? Yeah. So the ART, the alveolar recruitment for ARDS trial, uh, was a trial where we aimed to assess whether uh, a strategy, an open language strategy, that is with a language recruitment maneuver, and uh, PIP titrated according to the static compliance of the respiratory system would uh, be superior to the low PIP strategy in terms of uh, mortality, 28-day mortality in patients with uh, moderate to severe ARDS. Now, I know this was a, a large uh, randomized control trial. Can you talk a little about how you carried out the trial? Yeah. Uh, this, this study was conducted in 120 sites, uh, mostly in Brazil, but also uh, sites in, in with the participation of uh, other enthusiastic uh, intensivists in Uruguay, Argentina, Colombia, here in Europe, in Portugal, Spain, Italy, and Poland, and also in Malaysia. And uh, we enrolled uh, 1,013 patients during the, the trial. Can you tell us about the methods that you incorporated in this study? Yeah, we have uh, we have a design of the a language recruitment maneuver, uh, which which was based on, on previous uh, non-controlled studies. Uh, it was an aggressive maneuver in, in, in the data uh, involved the recruitment using pressure-controlled mode ventilation, and uh, it was a stepwise increase in PIP, starting from uh, 25 then 30, then uh, 35 with a driving pressure of 15, so that the peak pressure would go to 50 uh, centimeters of water, and the recruitment maneuver took three minutes to, to carry out. And after that, we would uh, 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 do a decremental PIP uh, trial, that is, would decrease the PIP uh, levels and uh, find the, the PIP level with the best compliance, which would be the optimal PIP. And then again, another uh, recruitment maneuver, this time a uh, single maneuver uh, with the 35 of PIP. And what were your expectations um, for the results? What did you think you'd find? Uh, based on the, the previous studies, um, we, uh, our, our expectation was that uh, most of patients would res respond in terms of uh, improving uh, compliance, in, in terms of um, having a high recruitability, uh, and therefore uh, uh, by by reducing uh, driving pressure uh, and, and, and improving language mechanics, we expected it to have an uh, impact on clinical outcomes. And indeed, uh, previous systematic reviews suggested that uh, th this strategy decreased mortality by about 15%. So our expectation was to, to, to see perhaps a, a reduction in mortality and to co confirm this, this, this information in this trial. So I know the results are embargoed uh, until after your presentation at the Hot Topic session, but uh, for those people out there who are attending this session, do you think that they're going to find the results interesting in terms of uh, uh, clinical implications? Yes, I think the, uh, I think the results are really uh, will be really unexpected and uh, because uh, this is a maneuver that uh, is is being carried out uh, or in many in many ICUs and even uh, suggested in guidelines so i think uh, the, the implications will be uh, important